Hey everybody, welcome to my final review for tonight. Um, I decided, because I haven't done this in a while, is to check out the uh, Dr. Webb, so I think it's like Security Pro, uh, comes with a firewall, parental controls, uh, guard, all sorts of different things. If we look at the version here, we'll see version 6.0.0. yada yada yada. So, uh, let me, I'll show you that it's fully updated. Alright, let's get started. This is just the firewall alerts. Looks like I found that one. Okay. That one was blocked. It's good to see. Okay, that one was blocked. And that one was blocked. Okay, this unknown application wants out on the firewall. Um, you could block it here. It says no rules for the application. I want to see if the antivirus will catch it, not just the firewall. So I'm going to let that out just to see how it does. Okay, last one. Alright. So, looks like it blocked a lot of them. And, uh, I'm going to do a scan now. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a full scan, and I'll be back when the scan is done. Okay, so the scan <clears throat> finally finished. Uh, took a while. And, um... I didn't find anything, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to run uh, CCleaner and then Malwarebytes. So I'll be back after Malwarebytes finishes running. Okay, so Malwarebytes finished scanning, and it found five things. Let's see what it found here. Okay, we definitely have some stuff. Uh, this is the one that I had in download that I didn't find that I downloaded. 
we have a Z-Bot and a registry key change, key change for that Z-Bot. We have that worm that's uh, saved right here. And we have another uh, registry key change. So let's see where, where that goes. There you go. So I'm going to remove these. And then uh, I'm going to do a scan with Hitman Pro. So I'll be back after Hitman Pro finishes scanning. Okay, so Hitman Pro finished scanning and it found another Trojan sitting in the driver's folder. So there you go. Um, Dr. Webb still has some more work to do. Um, personally, I wouldn't use it right now but they do make very good um, removal software. So like Curate and uh, Live CD uh, is very, very well soft, very, very good software at cleaning infected computers, especially the Live CD. Um, but their protection seems to be lacking a little bit, especially zero day uh, protection. They need to work on that a little bit. But other than that, um, you know, it looks like they're getting a little better now. Um, hopefully their next version will do even better. So that's it for this review. Um, everybody take care and have a good day.